What is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. My name is Sparkman and I'm a game developer and animator. Today I want to show you how to animate cartoon characters using a um, Crazy Talk Animator. You can animate anything using Crazy Talk Animator. So let's open it. If you don't have it, download it. The link is down below. If you don't have Crazy Talk Animator, the link is down below. So download it. For this example, I'm going to use a uh, character that's very similar to um, uh, South Park. So let me just copy this. We're going to rip off some of these characters. Okay, uh, I'm gonna go 1280 by shaving 20. And uh, let me just paste this here. And we are going to create characters uh, similar to this. Okay, let's first create our background. Okay, uh, that's gonna be extremely simple. We're gonna use the same colors. Okay, uh, let me just. Um, actually, I'm just gonna trace this. Screw it. Trace it. There we go. There's our sky. And um, some uh, the mountains. Let's let's do the uh, l uh, let's do the pines first, I guess. Uh, another layer. Gonna call this one trees. Now you don't have to do this, guys. This, this is just purely cosmetic. All right. So this is the trees, and uh, let me just fade this a little bit. Uh, just grab the color there first and fade and fade the actual picture. All right. So let's make the tree here. And some trees. And we're not making it exactly like it. Kind of like it. Okay. This is going to be green. Oops, not there. We're going to need the a new layer. There is. There's our tree. And now, um, and now it needs some... Um, I just need some white. To make it look like it's... Um, okay. There we go. New layer, and uh, let me just add the snow to this. Let's snow. Let it snow, let it snow. And snow here at the bottom. Now, if you're lazy, you could uh, you could just clone the same tree and more and make it look like a m and let make it look like more trees. Stupid uh, Windows 10 randomly pops out like this. This is this is like completely random. Like what the hell? All right, let's see. Just um, move this around a little bit. Make a few of these. Make them smaller. Obviously, they're farther away. Uh, if you have time, you can probably make uh, trees that are um, different shapes and you know do your stuff there. Let's see. Uh, now with the snow, luckily for us, the snow is white, so we can just uh, do this like this and paint it white. There's our snow, <laughs> just like that. Now the mountains in the background, uh, they're a bit uh, darker, I believe. Okay, it's a little, just a little tiny darker. And uh, let me just, uh, I'm simply just gonna. Paint the whole thing green like that, just because we can. All right, and uh, let me bring out the sky. There is our sky there, just like that. So simple. We take some of these and uh, make them even smaller so they look like they're farther away. All right, there is our trees there. So uh, let me just hide all that stuff there and uh, let me make some backgrounds. Should I make the stop sign there? I guess I guess we could. I guess we could make the stop sign. That's going to be super simple. Uh, it's just a yellow stop sign. Okay, and it has a brown pole. Oops. It doesn't need to be exactly like the picture, guys. It's just... I mean, this is cartoons. I mean, cartoons, you can get away with anything. Anything is possible. And, of course, if you want something more professional-looking, you probably want to take your time. But uh, for us, we're just goofing around here, so... Yeah. 
anything goes. I don't even remember what's in the picture. What's in the picture? It's uh, okay. Maybe I can just trace it. Okay, very original guys. Yeah, it's just copying other people's work. <laughs> All right, let's see. Mm. All right, the point of this example is not originality. I'm just showing you that uh, you can do this stuff. Um, anybody can do this stuff, especially if you trace it, like me. Okay, um, a lot of people get mad at me sometimes because I um, I copy other people's work, and um, yeah, that's just the nature of the beast. Sometimes people say, oh man, you're not original. No, okay, don't reinvent the wheel, guys. Don't reinvent the wheel, okay? The wheel has already been invented. So I'm gonna create a character sort of like, um, what What was his name? I, I, can't, I haven't even watched South Park in such a long time. Carmen or something? I think it was Carmen. Carmen, Car Carmet? <laughs> I don't even remember. All right, so let me just, um, Colors, uh, just uh, copy this and uh, we're gonna sample the yellow and the skin color. Okay, and uh, I think that's it. Maybe the shirt. This you don't have to worry about the, the, the colors. I mean, you can make your um, colors whatever way you want okay um, uh, somebody told me that these were actually done in Maya okay I don't know how true that is make another layer and this is going to be my first character okay maybe this one here uh, back to uh, the fat guy so maybe I can just make a circle probably be easy a circle uh, maybe use the color skin skin color okay and uh, the hat uh, but the hat's yellow well, the tip is yellow and it doesn't have to be identical to the actual character okay it could be anything how is it? Uh, his hat is uh, his ha his hat is blue, so painted blue, and he has a yellow line. Okay, we're making a cheap ripoff of a South Park. Uh, the eyes we're gonna insert those in um, Chrissy Talk. Okay, make the body. Okay, that's the shirt there. And I don't know why I sampled the colors if I'm just doing it uh, as we go. <laughs> why did I do that? I have no idea. And uh, here are the hands. The other hand. Now those are not gonna move. Um, so I don't really care. And uh, let me see the pants. The pants. I don't think red and brown kind of fits. So I'm just gonna make his pants some other color. Let's try. What what goes with red? Um, let me see. Yeah, give him a dark blue pants. Okay. And his shoes and his shoes, they're sort of gray. Wow, that's not great at all. Uh, did it have buttons? I think it did. Yeah, it has some buttons. And I'm not too worried about details and stuff. I'm, I really don't care. Alright, so that's our first character there, and um, I think I can just um, put it all in one layer. Okay, let me delete these um, color schemes, which we ended up not even using. 
Okay. That is our first character. And uh, I'm going to make this one here. Wow, I cannot even remember the name of this character. Do you remember the name of this character? Do you still watch South Park? Uh, I bet you do. Okay. So I'm going to make something similar to him. Not exactly quite like it. Did I make a new layer? I think I did. Okay. And uh, I don't have to take the red here, make the hat. Now, if you make vectors, you can probably uh, get a smoother, a smoother look. But just for this example, I, I really don't care. I just it's for your own personal use, guys. So don't worry. This is not. You're not stealing work or anything. Now, I've seen other cartoons um, in the same kind of style, so... I guess if you make your own, it don't matter. It doesn't matter. I don't think it does. And that is our um, body. The glibs. Again, I'm not concerned about the detail, so... There we go. And as I mentioned, since this is just for a life, I really don't uh, care if it comes out bad or not. Okay. One foot. Another foot. And again, we're gonna insert the eyes in uh, Crazy Talk Animator, so not to worry. So there is our uh, our character. Oh, and he has a scarf. Okay, so let's give him a scarf. A scarf, like so. Maybe even add a little detail. And, um, oops, I think I did it backwards. <laughs> the buttons go on this side. All right. Who cares? Who cares? Um, I actually, I think we should give this guy also a uh, scar too, because he doesn't have one and he's going to get cold. He won't, but... So there are two characters. Uh, you can make as many as you like. Uh, you can copy these. Oh my god! I just uh, did. I just do what I think I did. I did. Uh, all right. So let me just grab this here. Uh, M is for the uh, marquee select tool. Paste it. And uh, let me just uh, adjust it there. Bring it down. Bring it down. 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 And um, we're going to merge it with this uh, guy here. There, so it's now one piece. So now we can get rid of the original background. And uh, we are going to place our two characters here. Oh my god, I keep doing that. There we go. Merge, dang it. Control E, it's uh, merge, merge, merge. Like the month of merge, merge. Yeah, I can't say merch. I say merch. <laughs> All right. So there is the snow, and uh, there is the trees, and there is more trees, more trees, and more trees, and maybe just add one more tree at the bottom, at the at the back. Tilt it a little bit, and fade it. Nah, maybe not fade it. Whatever. Who cares? Who cares? One small detail here, which I really don't care uh, for, but I'm going to fix it, nonetheless. Yeah, it's been fixed. And uh, here is our um, two um, ripoff South Park characters, which are not really South Park characters, they're just similar. Okay, guys, remember, they're similar, they're not the same ones. 
Alright, I just added a cloud there just because I can. Export this uh, to uh, Photoshop now. Let me just fix this tiny little detail here. Right? Being bothered by detail today. There we go. Character 1, hide it. Character 2, hide it. And we are going to export the background. PNG file. We're going to call it uh, exactly that, background. And uh, we're going now we're going to hide the background. And uh, we're going to export our first character. Right here, I don't like that like that. Let me just uh, change the um, um, transparency color grid to dark. And uh, let me just uh, crop this um, character here. Shave it. Maybe I should colorize it a little bit, eh? And right here, there you go. More colorful. And we're gonna call this a character one because I cannot remember the name of that character. Wah, wah, wah. It's been a while. And uh, this here. And uh, let me just uh, crop this here, shave it. This will be character two. Uh, let's insert our background. Okay, uh, we want to insert our background. There is our background. So let's insert our first character. Let's um, click here. And uh, this will be character one. Let's add bones. Add the bones. Super easy. And the other arm. So this will be the neck, and this will be the head. All right, close this here. So we're gonna select uh, this bone here, and uh, we're gonna go, we're gonna go to layers, and let's duplicate it. Set the harness to a hundred. Make this a little smaller. And let's erase the body. Because we only need the head. Now if you're careful, you can do a good job. But uh, since I'm in a hurry here, um, all right, so that's fine. Let's remove the background. And close this here. So now we have a moving head. We want to convert this to a um, to a talking head. So let me just select the um, sprite base head. Select the angle. Okay, that's um, that's our head now. Let's uh, return to the stage and let's replace the head for something else. So you need to go to actor on their heads. Uh, we want to replace our head. Okay, so simply drag it, and uh, there is our new head. Let me uh, go back to the uh, composer. Okay, and we can adjust the head here. Uh, so what we can do here now, it's. Um, Uh, what I should have done first is, uh, let me just see here, let me undo this here. Okay. Uh, what we should have done here is um, save this as uh, separate. So that's what we're going to do right now. No big deal.
this ahead. Let me do the other one while we are at it. Okay. Got it. Oops. Got it and paste it. There you go. Let me save the uh, first one, which is the one we're using right now. Crop it and save it as head. This will be like head one. And this will be head two. Shave it. Call it down head two. Back to Crazy Talk Animator. Let me just uh, replace the um uh the sprite for this one here. Just make it bigger to fit your character. And um, close that. You can adjust the uh, the eyes to whatever you want. Okay. Oops. Now, if you don't need the eyebrows, you can hide them, or you can um, uh, you can simply delete them. Make it smaller. Okay. Uh, make the. Uh, Oh, it's a bit more round, more like South Parkish. That's a word now, South Parkish. Like it's Parkish. Sparshman. The Sparshman. There we go. And that kind of like it's not, it's not the same character. I mean, it's kind of like the same. Okay, and he has his own. Uh, Kind of similar, okay. Not quite the same. All right, so which is good for us. We, we don't want to make it 100% uh, identical. Now this here, that's the mask thing there. I uh, uh, let me just can I fix that mask there? Let me just see. I can probably just replace the whole body there. Where's the body? And uh, let me just uh, crop this. There's a lot of ways you can do this, guys. Uh, you don't have to stick to the norms. You can break the rules, like right now. Body one. All right, and while we're at it, maybe we should save the second body too, because it looks like we might run into the same issue. That's not really an issue, that's just because I didn't save that correctly. I didn't do the math correctly. And sometimes cutting corners can actually make you waste more time. Alright, there you go. Uh, so that's that. Um, let me replace the body. Oh, to replace it, all you have to do is uh, double click on it. And voila. Okay. There it is. Just adjust it there to the uh, to fit the bones, to fit your bone structure, and since we made the bones based on the original, uh, the copy should fit just perfect. Perfect. There you go. Uh, maybe a little over like that. And there we go. Okay. Okay, if you select the head now, you should move fine. 
so that's our first character there. Okay. Uh, let me bring in the second character. Alright, so I'm gonna bring in the second character, okay? So it will be the same process, so I, you don't need to watch the whole thing. So I'm just going to pause the video and bring in our character. I mean, it's up to you, Fogel. This guy's either gonna think, here's another kid with a fake ID, or here's McLovin, the 25-year-old Hawaiian organ donor. Okay, so what's it gonna be? I am McLovin. No, you're not. No one's McLovin. McLovin's never existed because that's a made-up, dumb fairy tale name, you Jeez, man, it'll work. Give it a chance. Did you ruin my... Where's my car? Oh my god, man. Didn't I tell you? What did I say to you? I told you not to park here. Why would you park in the staff parking lot? I mean, because you're not staff. I know that! I know that! Okay, so that is our character, and uh, let me just go back to the um, back to the stage. Okay, and I believe I can flip this. Okay, so so it looks like they're talking. So now we're gonna bring in some audio for them uh, to talk. Okay, so I um, I already have something. So let me just save this here first in case I lose it. You never know the power could go or something. It's happened before. So let's bring in some audio. Okay, click here. And uh, we're going to use a WAV file. Now, where did I save that? Here on their voices. Character 1. CH1. And, um, oh, sample rate. Okay, I, I, I use, I use Sirius. <laughs> Let me just fix that now. And I'm going to open stupid Adobe Edition. Welcome to another video. My name is Sparkman. Wait a second. How can we get some today? All right. I'm gonna save this as an mp3 and let's import it welcome to another video my name is Sparkman wait a second how can we get some today just like that uh, let me bring out the uh, voice for the second character maybe Sparkman is making another animation example all right uh, let me uh, shave that as an mp3 uh, you can in import waves in um, into a um, crazy talk animator it's just that I saved it in a weird format I don't know why let me bring that let me bring character 2 here character 2 uh, yeah maybe like so bring that back Welcome to another video. My name is Sparkman. Wait a second. How can we get some today? Maybe Sparkman is making another animation example. Okay, I uh, did it wrong. Okay, and let me just undo that. You have to insert the sound right here. <laughs> I inserted the sound here, so don't make that mistake. Uh, let me bring this sound again. Wave file. Character 2. So now this should be Welcome synchronized. Welcome to another video. My name is Sparkman. Wait a second, how can we get some today? Maybe Sparkman is making another animation example? Eh, uh, yeah, maybe. Like the video and subscribe. Alright, that's not too bad there. Not too bad. You can animate the uh, the facial expressions. So let's do that. Select our character here. All the facial expressions, you can uh, preview these. Press um, the space bar. Okay. Looks good. Uh, let's record that. Welcome to another video. My name is Sparkman. Wait a second. How can we get some today? Maybe Sparkman is making another animation example? Eh, uh, yeah, maybe. Like the video and subscribe. Okay. Let me uh, press play. Welcome to another video. My name is Sparkman. Wait a second. How can we get some today? Maybe Sparkman is making another animation example? Eh, uh, yeah, maybe. Like the video and subscribe. Okay. Uh, let's do the same thing for um, our other friend here. And uh, again, we can preview this.
Welcome to another video, my name is Sparkman. Wait a second, how come we're cartoons today? Maybe Sparkman is making another animation example? Eh, uh, yeah, maybe. Like the video and subscribe. Alright, so that's not too bad there actually. Uh, Alright, so you get the point. Okay, so now we're gonna export this as a video, okay? All you have to do, it's uh, click render, render video. And uh, we're going to select the MP4. Let's see, we can make this uh, 4K. We're gonna export from um, 1 to 469 frames. Let's um, call this, I'm gonna call this a snow scene. Just like that. Let's open it, see what it looks like. Welcome to another video, my name is Sparkman. Wait a second, how come we're cartoons today? Maybe Sparkman is making another animation example? Eh, uh, yeah, maybe. Like the video and subscribe. <laughs> so, so there you go, guys. Alright guys, if you got any questions, don't forget to leave a comment down below. Actually, comment down below anyways. Smack the like button and subscribe, if you're not subscribed. Also, there is a bell next to the subscribe button. Click on the notification bell. Thanks for watching, guys. See you in the next video. Bye now.